Hey, beautiful people. Welcome to my channel. I'm Donato Tarot, 1122. All right, Leo, let's get into this reading. Let's see what we got going on for the tribe. Keep in mind that uh, this will not resonate with everyone. All right, take what fits and leave the rest. All right, give me the messages. All right, wow, well, I, got some, I got some weird energy all of a sudden. Give me messages for Leo. Leo, somebody here has someone that wants to make some type of romantic gesture towards you. Maybe you might receive some type of messages here. Somebody actually might give you a card here. All right, let's see. Oh, oh my God, look at this. All right, so Leo. Okay, so you got a few things here. We have new purchase, spending money. Addiction, codependency, and a copycat, unoriginal, cheater, or follower. All right, and with that being said, um, can you, you guys do your girl a favor? Well, do all of us a favor here and say some prayers for the tarot community. There's a bunch of BS going on around again. And, uh, yeah, the devil is busy all the time, all the time, okay? So if you could just ask to keep us light workers covered. Uh, yeah, as well as yourself, those of us, uh, those of you that do, you know, rock with us or whatever, uh, just ask for that protective hedge around us, okay? Because there's a lot of stuff going on here. All right, let's see. Give me one for new purchase and spending money. All right, Leo, so we're manifesting money and we're manifesting what it is that you want. We want that car, that house, right? I'm just saying. All right, so there's that. Whatever it is, you're manifesting the money to um, purchase whatever it is that you, you're wanting here. All right, give me messages for addiction. Trying something, finding something out, codependency. Okay, is this dealing with someone that you know? Maybe you have some addiction, some codependencies to something or whatever. I don't know. I know I'm addicted to Starbucks. I need rehab. <laughs> I'm just saying. All right, so let's see. What is copycat? It's kind of crazy because stalking, looking through your socials. Who is this? Leo. You got someone here that keeps tabs on you, baby. Whatever it is that you do. This person is watching, lurking, looking, stalking, okay? There's that. I don't know why. Possibly because somebody is clocking your dollars, honey. They don't like what you got going on, okay? You could be having, you could be having, oh my God, mm, my English today. All right, you could have someone who is coveting everything that you want, okay? Um, Leo. You could have a nice whip, okay? You could be fine as hell. Most of you are. I'm just saying, you know you are. Stop playing, right? I'm just saying, you know you fine as hell. All right, money looking good. You looking good. And guess what? You got your boo thing on your side. Is that why that person is really, really pissed? I don't know. They may be looking at all the good stuff that's going on in your life. The people that come towards you, that gravitate towards you, that love you. You understand what I'm saying? That respect you and respect whatever it is that you have to do, baby, okay? So I think that's the problem here is that you have someone here that's trying to find out everything that they can about you, all right? This person here may be the one that is addicted to watching you, to stalking you okay this person may actually have some issues you know what i'm saying so i don't know honey but you got someone here that is definitely watching you manifest all the things that you desire in your life but sweetheart let me tell you when your faith walk is right you understand when that 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 um your your manifestations when you set your intentions and you giving it to the most high and you trust in him or her or whoever your person is with it you understand that you're doing the work that's what's gonna happen you're gonna get the blessings you're gonna manifest what it is that you want look at that all right and some of you are actually you may be readers and things like that you know maybe you work in the spiritual um community here 
And I'm going to put it to you like this. You know what? Because the devil will actually bless his people too. But I'm going to put it to you like this. You can tell when you have a calling on your life. You understand? First of all, you're going to get people that try to tear you down, try to doubt, you know, make you doubt who you are and whose you are. You understand? And all kind of things like this. And then they're going to gravitate to other people to try to gather them to come against you. Okay? First of all, that is not of God. Okay? That is not of light. So you already know who the, who's the ruler of that person's light, life is. All right? But Leo, you can tell when God is pleased with you by the blessings on your life. You understand what I'm saying? So just keep in mind, keep doing what you're doing. Don't worry about the naysayers, honey. You keep doing what you're doing. Keep staying uh, close to the most high and manifest those things that you want into your life, okay? There's that. And I'm going to put it to you like this. Whoever's tongue wags against you, it shall fall. All right, time about to fall off right into the middle of their lap. In other words, they're going to eat the words that they have, you know, spoken over you, especially if it is not true. All right, so someone here may be trying to assassinate your character or something like this, maybe trying to cause you some type of stress or grief, Leo. But I'm going to tell you, God is on your side. You got blessings coming through. Don't trip. All right. So, anywho, moving on, what is this new purchase? You know what? Actually, I think I'm just going to clarify this as a whole because I got to go to work. I don't want to go. Let's see. In other words, I got to turn my chair around and open this curtain. In. <laughs> you know what I mean? So there's that. All right. Let's see. Give me messages about this situation for Leo. Leo, that's a trip. Look. What did I say? What what did I say? Did you hear me? Okay. I told you you got some abundant blessings coming for you, sweetheart. Look, some of you, it's not even about the money, sweetheart. It's about your spiritual growth, okay? You manifest the things that you want, okay? When you speak your words, you help heal. You help grow, help others grow. You understand what I'm saying? People come to you. They gravitate towards you. You understand what I'm saying? So, I, I love this for you, Leo. And I'm not just saying this because I'm a Leo. You know what I mean? It has nothing to do with, with me here, sweetheart. I'm reading the cards as I see them. And like I said, somebody is, um, you know, very abundant here. All right? In multiple ways of their life. Full of knowledge. You understand? Wisdom here. You love on people. You know what I mean? And it's genuine. So, you know, you're a wealthy person by nature and it doesn't necessarily it doesn't have anything to do with money here sweetheart you can manifest that you understand what i'm saying you can manifest that but somebody is looking at your inner being and they don't like it all right you have that true empress energy all right so there's that relax because mm -mm. what we're not getting ready to do is is deal with this absolutely not you are beneath me how dare i get in the ring with you Absolutely not. You understand? I shall not step off of my throne mm -mm, and break down everything that I built to get into this energy with you. No, sir. No, ma'am. Y'all go on and run with that. <laughs> and, and yeah, I'll just stand on the sidelines while I continue to do what I need to do and watch you go on and make a mess. All right? I No, absolutely not. Life is too beautiful and too peaceful for me to voluntarily jump into this. Why? Because you got an issue? Mm -mm, absolutely not. Okay? There's that. So, this is crazy. You got some good news coming here for you, uh, Leo. Possibly an opportunity. Some of you, you have opportunities for a new job, new career. There could be a move here. Somebody here could be um, purchasing a home or, like I said, moving into uh, a new job. Or some of you could be relocating because guess what? You're about to get married, honey. All right? You and your boo thing. About to set up shop somewhere else, okay? Like I said, Leo, for someone here, it looks like you got everything going on in your life. Everything is it's your season, sweetheart. Mm -hmm. All right? You're looking good. All right? We always know you smell good, right? I'm just saying. <laughs> There's that. You're happy. You understand? And, and nine times out of ten, it's possibly that why somebody is watching you. Because how in the hell is Leo so happy? I want what Leo has. 
And if I can't get it, I'm going to try to destroy it. All right. So, Leo, you got to be careful with this. And, you know, just keep in mind who's in your circle. Because like I always say, sweetheart, the people that are smiling with you are not always glad that you got something going on. Okay. Sometimes they're grinning at a at a um, an opportunity. Look, Leo, all I can say is, baby, congratulations. Whatever it is that you're doing, you stay steadfast, okay? I don't care who's coming against you. You keep your eye on the prize, on the most high. You understand what I'm saying? Go run and get your blessings, baby. All right? It's all good in the hood. I'm just saying, go get what's yours because it's got your name on it, all right? And somebody is trying to get you to trip and, you know, renege on your blessings. Absolutely not. Going to go get everything that is for moi, right? That's right. All right, give me more for Leo, please, and thank you. Look at this. Look at this. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, look. All right, the high priest has actually landed over here on my phone. Look, source, God, source, universe, him above, okay, maybe sending you some downloads right about now. All right, some of you are mastering, mastering your spiritual life here. All right. I'm just saying some of you guys are so in tune. You understand? I'm just saying you just, you know, and other people know too. I'm just saying it, it is what it is. And somebody is really threatened by your gifts, by your intellect, by your intuition, by your connection with the most high. All right. But sweetheart, that's their problem. All right. There's that. Give me messages. We're a king's kid. We're a child of the most high. And God takes care of his own. Right. There's that. There's that, Leo. That what I'm about to end this reading right here. Because, baby, failure is not an option, okay? You're about to see your way through all of this mess. And somebody's about to watch you go through it, too. All right? Keep your eye on the prize. And like I said, always stay connected with the Most High. Especially when the adversary is busy, busy, busy. You know when the devil comes against you? Mm, you know you must be doing something. You know you got a blessing that's right around the corner, okay? So when people come by and they try to persecute you and they try to throw you under the bus and they talk bad about you and they're recruiting friends and family members, just look at Leo. You understand? Don't trip, Leo. Don't trip, okay? Usually you're in some type of ascension, sweetheart, okay? So that storm that you're going through, it's an elevation, okay? It's some stairs in there, all right? I'm just saying. And actually, you're in the spin cycle, all right? When you're in the spin cycle uh, in the washing machine, it's wringing out your clothes. It's getting rid of all of that unnecessary water, all right? That's going to take too long for your clothes and stuff to dry out. So, baby, you are in the rinse cycle right about now. Or should I say spin cycle, you're spinning all these unnecessary people out of your life, all right? People are being exposed. They're showing you their true colors. Tell me how you really feel. Oh, my. Okay, so as long as you're doing better than me, then it's, it's okay, you know? But once some blessings come from me, you just look at it. You understand? Thank you for that. I'm glad you showed me that. Hey, I'll never darken your doorstep again, and neither will you on mine. All right? How about that? All right? So, Leo, again, I just want to show you this. Look at this. Go get your go get your blessings. Step into your calling. All right. You are probably already have, but quit playing. Go hard. All right. I'm just saying. The hell with what the adversary is doing. You must be making headway if they're coming after you. Okay, my love. Like I said, you know what? It doesn't matter what the devil tries to do, sweetheart. We gotta be like Job. Ooh, that's hard. But I'm going to tell you, been there, done that. I lost a whole bunch of things and a whole bunch of people. But you know what? I'm still here. Like Seely. <laughs> I'm still here. I'm just saying. All right. So what's with this copycat, unoriginal cheater who follows you? Look at this. All right. So somebody here is double-minded here as well. They're very impulsive. Somebody's all over the place here too. And this person possibly watches you online in secret. Give me messages. This may be somebody that wants to reach out and say something to you. Yeah. They want to say something to you. However, they're a bit indecisive about it here too. I'm going to tell you something. Leo, whoever this is, like I said, this person sees that you are happy and for someone, they see that you are very successful 
or you get a lot of attention. I don't know what it is that you do, baby, but this person is watching you and they don't like it. All right. They don't like it at all. That's crazy. Anywho, give me messages about this situation. Ooh, King of Swords in reverse, baby. For some of you, this could be somebody that was in your friend circle. Mm -hmm. Be patient. Wait for it. Wait for it. The truth is going to come out, honey. All right. You're going to find out some stuff. Yeah, somebody going to say something, do something. You understand? Show you something. You're going to figure it out. You're going to know exactly who this is. Just be patient. You probably already know who this is. This is crazy. You got a Judas in your camp, Leo? Mm-hmm. Yep, and you walking away from it too, leaving it behind. Absolutely paying no mind, no attention. What I get, Leo, is that somebody here is having a temper tantrum because you're not paying them any attention. I don't have the stuff that Leo has. They don't pay me no mind. I'm trying to get their attention and they won't talk to me. Somebody a little off, somebody a little crazy. Leo, I see why you don't talk to this person, why you don't deal with this person. Give me messages here. They're looking through your socials. Somebody is like obsessed with this too. Yes, honey. Somebody watches you online. My God. Yes, somebody watches you online. For some of you, if you travel and things like that, this person may pop up in the same city and things like that where you are. Just you got a you got a real genuine stalker here. All right, this person is holding back communication right about now, but they are definitely watching in secret. All right, so, Leo, this is weird. For some of you, this is a family member that you've ended things with or something that has to do with family. And, and if it's not family, this may be somebody in your community. Yeah, but whatever it is, you're going to get clarity on this situation to find out who this is. There you are, King of Wands. Whoever this is, you're going to cut communication with this person. All right? Cut them smooth off. And then you know what's the trip? is because what I'm getting here, Leo, is that somebody here... Look, baby, you go. Go for it. Look at you, Empress. Mm-hmm. Abundance. See, this is what's bothering this person. And then on top of that, some of you have literally walked away from this person and left this person out in the cold. Once you walked away from this person, things started literally happening for you, like, overnight. Made me a millionaire overnight. I'm just saying, you know? It is what it is. So, I don't know, Leo, but whoever this is, honey, the you sure got their attention. Like, a lot. Like, this person has no life. Let's see. At all. Like, <laughs> my God. Like, they made a 24-hour business of watching you. That's crazy. Trying to keep up what you're doing with what you're doing. All right. Financial loss. Expected money loss. Look, from their intentions. So, this person could be going through some financial loss because they keep with you. You know what I mean? Damn, yeah, mind your own business. Stay in your lane. If you don't watch Leo, you wouldn't know what Leo is doing. All right? I told you. They're lacking your abundance. Didn't I tell you that you're very abundant? Everything that you touch turns to gold, okay? Even when you're not trying to. You're talking to other people and things like that and dropping diamonds on them. Dropping, giving some little seeds. And guess what? Other people are flourishing too but just because you gave them that idea or that encouragement, that hug. That it's, it's going to be okay. You got this. You understand? understand what I'm saying? And Leo, your abundance has a little bit to do with your financial situation. But like I said, sweetheart, you are abundance from within. You understand? You exude love. All right? So I love this for you. You understand? I don't give a damn. People talk mad shit about us, Leos. But we love hard and we'll do anything for anybody that we love. And we are protective over our people. How about that? They can't stand that you got it made. Who am I talking to? I'm just saying. I'm just saying, you better talk and confirm everything that I said. They will play the victim once they know they're losing. Absolutely. All right. So let's see. Give me messages. Give me two more about this weirdo. 
overactive crone. They are obsessed with spirituality, uh-huh, but possibly using dark magic with this type of energy here. They are blocked by holding on to grudges. Ooh, look at this, uh-huh. So, I don't know what this person, why this person is pissed off at you or whatever, but um, this person can't come towards you the way that they want. Ooh, somebody's about to face some karma here. Something has been blocked for your own protection. Absolutely, it's this person. All right, pause. Things slow down for a reason. Absolutely, don't trip, okay? Because somebody is trying to trying to mess with your energy here. So it's just like, don't trip, I got him. I got him, I see, I see him, I see him. All right, so. Source sees all. Absolutely, and this just confirms everything that I just said. So you got someone that is hating on you. Not just for what you have, but for who you are. All right? So the calling on your life. <laughs> you can't help the source said, hey, you know what? This is your job right here. All right? And I expect for you to do it well. All right? So there's that. All right? This reading that made me hot. Golly, that's crazy. Uh, so, whoever's reading this is, sweetheart, y'all watch a circle. Watch the people that you're around. And when this person tries to bait you into to stupid-ass arguments and things like that, don't, don't bite, honey. Don't bite. You already know what's going on. The adversary is a little nervous, okay? And I'm going to put it to you like this. If you are any type of light worker or anything like that, if you're a healer or whatever... You know what I'm saying? You're trying to do good out here and help people, you know, realize that there are some things going on that they need to heal from, too. If you are any type of healer in doing anything positive, expect the adversary to send his little demonic winches or whatever it is you want to call them after you. OK, that's the job, sweetheart. We are in the last days. We are in a spiritual battle here. It's the dark versus the light, okay? And you got some light workers that, hey, they're doing their job. And you got some pretendos that, you know, the placebo light workers who claim to be light workers that are into destruction, all right? They are tearing down other communities, other readers or whatever, instead of doing what they're supposed to do on their end, you understand? And it's not only readers and things like that, you understand? It's happening in the pool pit, in the church, and all kind of stuff. People are being exposed, you understand? And you're being exposed for who you really are. And it's going to happen all the way around, okay? So all I can say is that, sweetheart, don't match that energy, okay? Because if somebody is coming towards you, you know it's the adversary, all right? Especially if you're out here doing what you're supposed to do for the most high, all right? So just expect the adversary to come towards you in multiple ways. Please know that you have a prayer warrior here. I'm definitely praying for you as I'm praying for myself too, because trust me, I've had some people come after me as well. So, but it is what it is. You just showing me who your Lord and Savior is, okay? And we don't serve the same master. I'm just saying. So, Leo, keep your head up. Don't worry about the enemies against you because always God is for you, okay? All right, so someone has been doing candle magic work on you. As a flame burns, their energy increases, but they use reckless magic. Someone is out to control and doing anything and everything to any and everyone they want without having any remorse, okay? So that lets you know that this person is attacking multiple people. They don't give a damn. And like I said, it's letting you know who this, you know, whoever this is, who the ruler of their life is. God is not the author of confusion, okay? All right, love binding spell. Someone is working to have you so tied to them. My gosh, all right, in a negative or a positive way. Look at this. I won't say a positive way, but yeah, somebody is trying to keep you bound to them. This could actually be someone that you are in a relationship with. I don't know. And it doesn't necessarily have to be a relationship. You know, you could have someone, a friend or a family member that you're not dealing with, haven't been dealing with, that that person is trying to call you back to you. You know, call you back to them, okay? Beckoning you. All right, so I don't know. And then it's with turn to sender. Uh, with energy work, cleansing, and prayer, what they did to you will be sent right back to them with a nice, neat bow. All right, give me messages. Anything else? Demon magic here. 
Look at this. All right, so Leo vibe clearing. You need to incorporate a regular habit of using protective, um, sorry, protection herbs, Palo Santo, sage, etc. to cleanse and clear negative energy from your surroundings on a weekly basis. Okay, so in other words, you got someone that's really, you know, this person is really gunning for you. All right, demon magic. Someone is conjuring demons to block your blessings and bring harm your way, but no weapons formed against you shall prosper, prosper okay? Uh, it doesn't mean that you won't get a little singed, you know what I'm saying? But the thing is, is that Source is always um, walking before you, and sometimes Source will actually let you go through some things because uh, he likes the glory. Hey, you know that situation you was in? You couldn't get out of it yet. It was me. <laughs> I'm just saying, okay? So, yeah, I think I put my other cards in the wrong doggone thing. I did. And y'all going to bear with me for a minute, if you would, please. Because, yep, here you are. I was looking dead out. Yes, and I did put some of my labels on, and I didn't put the rest. So. There's that. All right, so what other messages do we have for Leo? That's crazy. It's like that weird ass lady was attacking me on YouTube. <laughs> like, ma'am, you still in my work, ma'am. I barely have enough time to post on my own channel, let alone go on somebody else's and look at what you doing. I don't care enough to do that. I'm just saying. All right, give me messages. I'd rather spend time with my dogs. All right, Divine Feminine. <laughs> The feminine energy exhibits strong intuition and the ability to nurture, heal, and show compassion through gentleness and patience. Go on, Empress, with your bad self. This is, and it comes natural to you, sweetheart. This is just who you are, all right? There's that. You're being given a chance to do something over. What will you do differently? All right, so let's see. Give me two more for Leo, please, and thank you. What do we need to know? Hey, and this situation is unhealthy. Absolutely keep your behind up out of it, okay? Let that person battle all by themselves and let them look like a damn fool, all right? So whoever this is, friend, family member, or whatever, I don't know, your family loves you and can offer the support that you seek, all right? So, yeah, in other words, sweetheart, it doesn't matter who comes against you. It's who, who's for you, all right? The most high, and you got people that love you and support you and protect you. They go hard for you, honey, just like you go hard for them. So don't trip. You got this. You're going to be okay. Like I said, know that this situation is unhealthy. So if somebody's bringing it to you, don't give it back to them. Give it to God and let it go. Keep it pushing. The best thing that you can do is show these people no attention at all because pretty much that's what's happening. You don't give me no attention. <laughs> Shoot. I'm just saying. All right, so it says, adopt a healthy state of mind, free from illusions, clutter, and other negative influences. Absolutely. All right, that's what I'm talking about. Don't allow this negative energy, this negative influence to infiltrate your mind, all right, your soul, uh, way heavy on your countenance. You understand what I'm saying? Because what it's trying to do, my love, is trying to stop you from what you're doing. You got this. You stepped into your purpose. You know who you are and whose you are, okay? Keep it pushing, all right? How about that? We don't stop in the face of adversity. We go hard. We don't go home, all right? I love you guys. You have an amazing rest of your day. If I don't talk to y'all for the rest of the week, know that I'm spending, I'm spending, I'm spending time at work. <laughs> know that I love you and I'm praying for you, okay? Um, if you need some prayers or whatever, put your name in the description, but not in the description box, in the comments or whatever. And yeah, when I say my next prayer, I will definitely incorporate you in them, okay? And uh, yeah, I would ask y'all to pray for me, but I'm just saying. <laughs> just put some prayers out there for our community for healing and things like that, okay? Because it's much needed. And uh, yeah, we are all going through. It doesn't matter if you're a Leo. All the way from Aries down to what's the last sign, <laughs> whatever that sign is or whatever. We're all going through it. And it's a sign of the time, sweetheart. It's not just you. It's all of us. Okay. Like I said, we are in the last days and we're going through a spiritual battle. So from now for the next few years, it's going to be some ish going on. So pick a side, pick a side. Who are you going to work for? I'm just saying we all know who's going to win anyway. So with that being said, I love you. Know that you are loved, protected and prayed for. Okay. And uh, yeah, you have an amazing rest of your day and I'll holler at y'all later. Bye.